Do you want to be able to fix snapshot support code C14A? Well, then you have come to the perfect video because in this video, I'm going to show you step by step exactly how to fix this. But it is very important that you actually do watch this video until the very end because I'm going to show you two steps to fix this and you need to do both of these steps. If you only do one of these steps, then probably this will not work just so you know. So it's very important that you stick until the end and try these two steps that I'm going to show you to fix this problem. So the first step is going to be quite easy. We need to firstly go into the App Store if you have an iPhone or Google Play Store if you have an Android. And in, when you're now on your either like on the App Store or Google Play, then you're going to search for Snapchat in here. So I'm just going to search for Snapchat just a second. And as you can see, I should now be taken here. I'm going to click on the Snapchat app in here. And then as you can see, I have this blue button in here where it says open. But if it says update for you, well, then it's very important that you do click on that update button just so you know. But if it just says open for you as it does for me, then perfect. Then that means that the step number two is completed. Now we can go into the step number, sorry, the step number one is completed. And now we can go into the step number two. So basically, I'm just going to close the App Store now and then go into my settings app. Now when I'm on my settings app, then I'm just going to scroll down in here. Now I'm going to click on general. And as you can see, I should now be taken here. What I'm going to do now is to scroll down and click on iPhone storage in here, as you can see. Now when you've like been taken here, then I'm just going to scroll down in here, click on snapshot. And then I'm going to actually, as you can see, there's two options for this, either offload app or delete app. And basically what, what I'm going to do now is to actually click where it says offload app. And it's very important, by the way, that if you are going to do that, as you can see, it says like this, this will free up storage used by the app, but keep its documents and data. Reinstalling the app will reinstate your data if the app is still available in the app store. So basically what will happen is that you will probably be logged out of your Snapchat account when you do this. So make sure that when you have actually, like when you're going to click on offload app, make sure that you know your username and password password for that snapshot account so that you don't like lose your account of course so i'm just ju i'm just going to click on offload app in here click on offload app again then this is going to take a couple of seconds and basically like now i should be taken here i'm going to click on reinstall app again because what will happen after this is that like you, you can see before it will free up st like storage used by the app and hopefully it will also fix all of the bugs that we have on our Snapchat. So basically this is exactly how to do this. So let me know in the comments below, maybe if you have any questions and I will try to answer to as many as I can. And also I wish you the best day.